Craig T. Nelson is uh, is with us. Hi. I used to. <laughs> I was Hi. the biggest coach fan. Do in you the have world. a cold? Do I? I do have a cold. A little nose cold thing. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Why do you have one? I just don't want to get too close to you. No, it's just a little swine flu. I'm very. <laughs> That's it. That's all it is. is. Well, don't take a plane. Yeah. <laughs> I would tell all oh, of my Joe family. Biden, he'll yeah. tell you what to do. You wouldn't take the plane, would you? Nope. You're live... getting in a confined space with him. You... <laughs> you live, can you imagine what a nightmare that would be? But you'd have all the nation's secrets. Yeah, he's probably a very nice yeah. guy. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Going. <clears throat> um, so, this uh... desk is very shiny. Thank you for pointing that out. You, know, you were in fights in the green room, weren't you? Yeah, Bill O'Reilly. He's huge. Not yeah. more. Yeah. I got his knees. Yeah, really? No, he's yeah. in my house every night. Yeah. I got it. And you too. Yeah, I'm really? Crazy guy. I've been looting your house. I've been house. watching your eyes. Remember yeah. That little Glenn back. <laughs> he's little. Yeah. I know. I know. So I know. California. Yeah. Huh? You're from California. It's no longer a state. It's a hedge fund. Yeah. You it's, know? Um, it's crazy. Well, I do have a solution. <laughs> There's only one way. We got to make them. You know, we got to make people stand up for the responsibilities. You know, they were accountable, and they haven't been. You know, no one is Wait accountable anymore for anything. No one did anything wrong. No one's. Everyone. Well, you're to blame. That's to blame. This is to blame. As an investor, as someone who gets taxed an awful lot, mm -hmm. I just say I'm not going to pay. So you guys can show me that you're fiscally responsible. Until then, listen. You know, the first thing they went after. Education. We're going to cut education. Why would they do that? Why? Mm -hmm. That's the most important thing in the world. Yeah. And then cops and prisons. And firefighters. Right. We Why don't I... have any fires in California. Yeah. <laughs> they were within half a mile of See, my house they, three times. When you, when, you saw Jay, uh, when, you, when you saw Jay Leno and Arnold Schwarzenegger. Is my voice really high? No, it's oh, just okay. a head cold. Um, it's the beginning of the swine flu. Um, i got to remember to breathe. The, uh, when you saw Arnold Schwarzenegger on uh, Leno the other day, did you? No, I didn't. Oh, okay. Well, basically, he said, I get the message now. I got the message now. We're no. not supposed to. Now you get the no, message? No, no, no. Uh, but look, we've had legislators. We are no longer represented, okay? We just aren't. And there's been a political fight. There's been a pluralism in our California government. You certainly see it reflected in the national government, don't you? I mean, people are, people are blaming each other. Nobody's taking responsibility for what they said or what they did. Yeah. And those people are responsible to us. They were elected. This is a democracy. So what do you do? Are it's you a serious? republic. Are you My God. Thank you for saying we're a republic. No, the we are a republic, and that means that we need to be represented. So we're not, are you being, we're not being listened. I'm not going to pay. I'm not going to pay any more money. What these people are asking me to do. You're seriously saying I'm not going to. You're not. No, gonna I'm asking money. Glenn Beck to promote this. I'm saying it personally, but I'm asking no, you. I know. Are you saying you personally won't pay income tax anymore? I'm really thinking about it, Glenn, because as a as a fiscally responsible grandfather, there are programs that they're asking me to fund that I refuse to fund. You know, I have to tell you, if I, the I, veterans coming back are not getting what they deserve, those people that have served that put themselves in harm's way. If my children, my grandchildren, and my great-grandchild, who's about to be here, thank you, grandson, mm. is not going to be educated properly, then I'm, I'm through with it. You know, I'm not going to spend money on these things that you're asking me to... They should be allowed to go bankrupt. What happened? We are a capitalistic society. Okay, I go into business, I don't make it, I go bankrupt. They're not going to bail me out. I've been on food stamps and welfare. Anybody help me out? No. No. They gave me hope, and they gave me encouragement, and they gave me a vision. And that came from my education. So to me, you know, going back to California and the hedge fund, because we're no longer a state, I just feel like going after our kids, our education, and the most valuable people we have on the planet, teachers. I, 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 I just got to tell you, well, I'm so sick and tired of it. Yeah, I'm just yeah. sick and tired of it. And I'm old enough now, and I've been in the business 45 years, they can't fire me. Yeah. Well, they can. <laughs> can always fire you. They can always fire you. Okay, well, uh, more with uh, Coach here in just a second. But hey, listen, great. here's the Declaration of Independence. Yeah, yeah, and yeah, I've yeah, got yeah. this for you. Yeah. Uh, not, I, I brought this for you. But there's a quote in here, it just is very, very m minimal. Uh, uh, Governments long established should not be changed for light and transient causes, and accordingly, all experience has shown that mankind are more disposed to suffer while evils are sufferable than to right themselves by abolishing the forms to which they are accustomed. Mm. Okay? But when a long train of abuses and transgressions, 
and I've had enough of it. So the only way that I can protest in any viable and visible form for myself is to say, I'm not paying you right now. Are you willing to go to jail for that? I'm going to go to jail, but I, I still think it's kind of a mafia deal because they've got a subcontractor who says they're extorting me, and they're saying, you're going to pay us this amount. I, what, what am I going to pay now? 90% um, of what I make? Mm -hmm. I mean, I've got California, mm -hmm. federal and state. Mm -hmm. uh, that's unfair. That's taxation without representation. I think if, I, I think if the United States government t takes over California's loans, I think it is taxation without representation. I couldn't vote for any of that. I couldn't vote for that. You're doing, you're, you people in California are saving the sea otters. I mean, I, I mean how about I like saving see, people? I like the sea otters. I like the sea otters too, but yeah. I think. And some priorities. people that want to save the sea otters should pay for them. Yes. But if I don't want to save the sea otters, you know, I mean, no, is that you're, anarchy? You're the first. No. Oh. This is American. That's what I thought, that's what and I'm that's what they were saying exactly was right. we When's have, the last time you read I'm Thomas mad Payton? as hell, and I'm not going to take it anymore. He's Peter our, Finch. He's what happened our to that? Deal. Well, look, at Patty Chansky wrote about it, and then you get into the medium. Is the message? No, you have to be quiet. You have to be docile. What do you do? You suffer. Yeah. You suffer. When's the last time you read Common Sense by Thomas Paine? Two years ago. I really? would guess, yeah. Wow. Yeah. It is, you read it again. Yeah. It is, it's on fire right now. It's on fire. I've just rewritten it. It comes out in about three, three weeks. I'll send you a copy. Would you? Yeah. Okay. You are, I, I tell you, I think you're the first person I've heard that is expressing the way I feel that, you know, you get to a point where you're like, enough. I, I, I'll go to jail. I will go to jail before I pay you another dime for this insanity. Because yeah. this is, this is, you're not responding. No. Everybody in America knows this is crazy. Why am I being forced to pay for these bailouts? I don't know. Why? You 72% now of General Motors. You know that? 72% of I General I didn't Motors. want to be in a car company. I didn't either. Otherwise, I would have invested in stock. That's correct. And I don't have that kind of stock. Right. I have real estate. Yeah. And that's gone down. In California. Yeah, please. A hedge fund. Mm -hmm. like I said, <laughs> but that was... All right. Yeah. What a pleasure. Hey, thank Hope you. to see you again. Am I done now? Can yeah, I stay done. for just a while? You. you can stay. We'll just... We'll just keep I could polish this up some more. All right. Oh, boy. We're gonna, am I in trouble? We're going we're gonna to tie the whole show together here. Honey, I didn't mean it all. Sweetheart. <laughs>